I always want people to make decisions with their eyes wide open. And when it comes to the CMA exam, you need to know how much this will cost. So let's talk money today. Paying for the exam is an investment in your future, but just how much of an investment really is. From the new 2022 CMA exam rates from the IMA to the course you pick, you're going to have to budget for this. I'm Nathan from cmaexamacademy.com. We help candidates like you pass the CMA exam the first time. There are some fixed and some variable costs for the CMA. So let's start with the costs you will have to pay and which won't change. These are the CMA exam fees from the Institute of Management Accountants or IMA for short. To become a CMA, you will first need an IMA membership. And there are three different types of membership levels, each of which has different costs. So listen in. An educator membership is for academics and is $135 per year, as well as a $15 application fee. A professional membership is for anyone who is not in college or graduate program, and it is for $260 plus a $15 application fee. Last is a student membership, which is for people who are still in college or in a graduate class, and you can buy it for a $45 fee. If you have already graduated, you do not qualify for the student membership. Instead, opt for the professional one. Note that the IMA technically also supports an employer program whereby the organization you work for would enroll you in the IMA membership and perhaps pay for part or all of it. The next fees you'll pay to the IMA is CMA entrance fees and exam fees. These costs are increasing in March 2022, so I'll go over what those are next. First, you'll pay the non-refundable CMA entrance fee, which is currently at $250 for professionals and is going up to $280. For students or academics, the entrance fee is currently at $188, but it's going up to $210. Second, you pay for the CMA exam itself. For professional members, the current fee is $415 per part, but it's going up to $460 per part. For students or academic members, the current fee is $311, but it's going up to $345 per part. All in, what you'll pay to the IMA could range from $779 to $1,400, a number that will go up in March. Now, an important change has taken place as well. Starting in the January, February 2022 exam windows, candidates can take their exams either in person or remotely. There are tech requirements to consider by using Prometric Pro Proctor. You will pay the same fees, but take the exam from any location you choose. And I'll record a video on this later on, but if you want to learn more about it now, I'll drop a link in the video description below so you can learn about it. So those are the fixed costs. I'm always interested to know how are you budgeting for the CMA? I've watched people get pretty creative to reach their goals, so share it in the comments below so we can help each other out. Now, in addition to the fixed cost to the IMA, you will need to plan to pay for a CMA review course and study materials. First, I know, there are some free resources out there, but the truth is pretty much everyone who passes the exam does so because they bought into a solid program. There's simply too much to learn to not have a comprehensive program in your hands. This is an investment though, and it can range anywhere from $500 up to $2,000. It's important to do a cost-benefit analysis and understand what program components are the most important to you. The cheapest program doesn't mean it's good enough, nor the most expensive, the best one. I'd also suggest reading online reviews, looking into past rates of people who went through the program, and basically doing your research just to make sure you'll get the most for your money. Your learning style should be the determining factor in helping you choose the right program as well. A higher priced study CMA program may feel like a stretch, but so is the cost of retaking the exam if you fail. The right program at the right price will get you the right results. In the video caption below, you'll find a link to a comparison table of the best CMA review courses to help you make the best decision possible. And of course, that doesn't mean everything valuable costs a pretty penny. 
Check out the link in the caption as well to get a copy of my free CMA exam cheat sheets. This is our freebie for you that will unlock even more secrets about how to pass the CMA exam. I'm here to help you navigate the big picture and the nitty gritty. So be sure to subscribe. All of the videos on here are free to you. And thinking ahead about the financial investment of the CMA exam is a good sign that your head is in the right place. Watch this video next on the mindset and habits you need to succeed on the CMA exam. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your time and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.